Gisela on there was too. Yeah. Tantric delinquent, Indian goddess, movie star. She becomes whatever Eddie imagines her to be. And, uh, well, Eddie remembers so. Uh, Colored lights swirling behind my eyes gather together, rush upward and clang, <laughs> climax, inner bell, clang, orgasm. Well, there's all this, just fantasizing. Still, it's a dinner table with uh, a Steve and Miriam in the restaurant. Well, uh, okay, uh, Eddie does a Charlie Chapman. Uh, cakewalk along the balcony uh, and uh, he plays invisible piano on the table. Scat sings uh, with the movements from his fingers. Uh, Alex, LSD uh, has transformed him <laughs> into carefree performance artist. Jeannie is out of the bottle as far as Eddie is Concerned, yeah. Oh. Well, um, next day, Gazella uh, tells him that she wants to have a baby with him. <laughs> He's amazed how different their head trips are. Yeah, they move to Fez. <sighs> Where Gazella, oh. Starts hanging out with a hustler named Hussan. They have sex, so, as usual. Eddie's cool, yeah. He tells Hussan, look, uh, Gazella and I try to be open. He smiles to himself as he flashes back about that trailer in San Blas, Mexico. The little affair between friends seems so. <laughs> Light and innocent by comparison, yeah. Oh. Gazella gets an urgent telegram from her mother who wants to rendezvous with her in Spain right now. Ridiculous rumors uh, that uh, have reached Denmark that Eddie is uh, pimping Gazella as a street whore in the Moroccan uh, brothel. Okay. And Eddie, he'll await her return <laughs> from Spain. Yeah, uh -huh. and he escorts her to the boat oh, to Tangiers, in Tangiers. And uh, oh, he notices a man in a dark suit standing nearby on the sidewalk. Oh, what's he doing there? Oh, this is not a bus stop. He can't be waiting for a girlfriend. He must be a cop. I'm being watched. Surprisingly, it's true. Yeah, undercover policemen haul Eddie in for questioning, and uh, they grill him about Gazella. Well, gets out of there. <clears throat> After that, uh, he quickly travels to Spain uh, to personally warn Gazella, don't come back to Morocco. The heat is on. Eight-fingered fugitive. Uh, he splits Morocco in a hurry. Abandons, his, abandons all his possessions. Uh, slips into the back seat of a taxi. The boat landing <laughs> to Dan, in Tangiers fast. Uh, he growls at the cab driver. Only once he's on the boat does Eddie start to feel safe. Again, yeah. Sudden flight from the law. Surprisingly liberating. Leaning on the deck railing, uh, looking at the churning Mediterranean Sea, Eddie reflects, yeah, I left my typewriter. <laughs> my unfinished manuscript, my dictionary, <laughs> and most of my ambitions to become a great writer. I'm traveling light. And I'm lacking it. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, Eddie's relationship with Flaky Gisela, mm, going downhill fast, yeah. 
Eddie tracks her down in nearby Tormalina, Spain, uh, where she's fooling around with Roger, her uh, latest drug, e boyfriend, yeah. Gazelle and Roger uh, coax Eddie into taking uh, speed from time to time, dexedrine tablets. Uh, drug he usually avoids, and unfortunately, the amphetamines heightens his sense of being uh, a fugitive. He sees cops everywhere. For example, I mean, on the speed, Eddie goes down to the beach, smokes a whole packet of cigarettes, and notices how gray the sea is after sunset. Members drowning, painless way to die. I'm speculating. If, if I allowed myself to drown, it would be much less painful than if I haul, fall into the hands of my pursuers. Yeah. Well, Eddie catches himself becoming suicidal. Eddie senses uh, Raja and Gazella are in trouble with the law and working for the police. Uh, after Gazella coaxes Eddie to have their picture taken together in a photo booth, even this she wants, the latest photos of eight-finger Addy to present to the police. 